Hey everybody, Justin Cena here. In this video, I'm gonna teach you and show you how to redesign and customize your entire Shopify store in just minutes. This is a really powerful video and this has been requested a lot by uh, my viewers. So this is for you and it's really all about redesigning your store and showing just how easy it can be, especially when you wanna stand out from the crowd. There's obviously so many different Shopify and e-commerce stores out there. How can you stand out? And really when you think about it, most stores, especially on Shopify, they're gonna go ahead and pick a theme. They might even probably pick the same theme that you've picked. And they're gonna customize things like the colors and the logos and obviously add their products. And then they're gonna go live. And there's really only so many customizations that you can do inside of the Shopify online theme editor. So what you wanna do as a Shopify store entrepreneur, of course, is create the perfect store for your brand and your products. But you wanna do it within the limitations of Shopify. And you also don't wanna to have to hire a very expensive uh, developer, a coder. So a popular strategy right now is to take advantage of what's called Shopify sections, and I'm gonna show you exactly how to use them. And this is gonna allow you to redesign your store to exactly match your brand and create the perfect storefront that you want. And there's really no built-in way to do this inside of Shopify. You need to go ahead and actually edit Shopify's liquid code. You can think about like HTML code in there, it's a little bit different. And you'd actually have to build, basically be a code editor or a programmer. And you want to find an app that's going to be able to do it for you, or you want to find a setup that's going to do it for you. I'm going to show you that later in this video. But you want to be able to find something that doesn't require you to be a coder yourself, right? Most of us are entrepreneurs. We want to deal with selling product. We want to build a brand. We're not really uh, kind of built to do coding. We don't have that type of experience. So obviously another alternative gets costly. Hire someone, pay them by the hour or something like that who are, you know, uh, kind of a pricey web developer or a coder. That's obviously out of the question because I'm going to show you quick code and they have these really cool pre-built Shopify sections. So we're not going to have to do anything other than just copy and paste. I'm going to show you exactly how easy it is to get this in there, but I highly recommend it. You see the link directly below this video. You can go into quick code. We're going to go over the shoulder and there's literally different sections, pre-built sections that you could just simply pick, copy and paste and add them into your store. I'm going to show you the entire process. It's super easy. And this is quick code right over here, premium pre-built Shopify sections and page layout templates. We can come over here and literally take a look at all of these. And we're talking about add a section anywhere on your Shopify store, do it yourself. You don't need to be a coder. You don't need to be a programmer or a graphic designer. You're going to be able to get all of these really cool sections here. You could pick and choose from all these sections, I should say, and get them into your store. Super easy, super flexible. There's a three-step process. Number one, you get the code, right? You're going to pick your section. They'll give you the code. Then you just simply copy and paste the code exactly where they tell you to do it. And then you add your content, right? It's going to be basically this is where you add your branding and your products or whatever's going to fill the sections that you choose. And there are so many cool Shopify sections over here. We can come over and view all, right? Literally all of these different sections and you know, you basically just pick whichever ones you want. There's a price for each one. And these will allow you to add into any Shopify theme. And you take a look over here, comparison table, for example, right? This is something really cool. Unless you find a Shopify theme that specifically has this, you're gonna to need to either get custom code, code it yourself, or now what you can do is get this comparison table directly from Quick Code. And you could scroll through here and see all these different, here's a really cool carousel uh, slider over here. This is a really cool one, before and after. Right, so you can imagine, depending on your products, this could be something that could really increase conversion, increase engagement on your store. Or right, maybe you think over here, this is a great way to, uh, you wanna showcase how you are better than your competition, but you don't really have a good visual way to do it on your store. Well, you could literally just go ahead and grab this comparison table. We're clicking here and just like any product, we're able to view a little bit more information about it. We see some different types of examples of how this could look. We can even go ahead and look at the demo over here. And now we can actually view live over here, the different sections. So we'll scroll over in here and I will do comparison table. We'll take a look at this in terms of the live demo over here. And this is exactly what we saw over here, but this is what we're gonna be able to add into our own store. Obviously we can change things like colors and see different examples over here. It doesn't have to just be these icons either, right? You see different setups. You'd have more rows, you'd have calls to action. So again, this is the quick code comparison table example, all these different ways to do it. And what you're gonna be able to get is the ability to customize all of these different things inside of the code. It's very, very easy to do and they show you exactly how to do it. And that's just one section. So you have all of this over here. It's gonna work with your theme and I'll show you exactly how to do that. And really all you need to do is just come over here and look at the sections and find the section or the type of section that you want. How about something with video? 
or something where we could highlight product features, right? This is really cool. If you have a great product, come over here and add a product feature. We could have a nice little box that looks like that. We could have, again, we see a lot of different uh, image ad adaptations over here. So very cool when it comes to the different feature sets that you'll be able to find. The idea, again, is being able to find the type of section that you want and then get the code by purchasing it over here. And these are totally worth the price. You get to customize all of the different options inside. It would be a lot more expensive to work with a developer to create anything close to this. They also have really great customer service available anytime. And we'll run through an example. I'll show you how to follow the instructions. But really, again, almost all of this can be customized. We'll come over here and take a look at the video image with text. And there's different implementations of how it could look. We see all these different styles over here. Here's a full width style. Here's how it could look on mobile. So of course they're thinking about how it's gonna look not only on desktop, but on mobile as well. And this is really, really easy in terms of how to add this section and how to customize everything right inside that Shopify theme editor. It's just about creating our own custom section first. And that's what the quick code, copy and paste code is gonna do. So really nothing to be intimidated by in terms of technological or coding. It's very simplistic. We'll go over the shoulder and I'll show you exactly how to do this. So I got the product benefits section and the marquee announcement bar section. And I'm gonna go ahead and install them into my Shopify store. You're gonna get an installation guide and a set of files for each one. And basically all we need to do is follow the step-by-step -step over here in terms of creating our own section. They're also developing a free app that would allow you to simply purchase the section and then install the section in one click through the app. But here's how you do it now. So you're going to come over here to online store and then themes. First thing you want to do, come over here and I just did it. You go click duplicate. It's going to go ahead and create a copy. The idea here is now we have a backup just in case we make some mistake because we're going to come over here and we're going to click edit code. And we're not going to need to edit any code. We're just going to go ahead and I'm going to show you. We're going to basically create a new section. So we see over here all these different sections over here, all these different kind of parts of the code. We want to scroll down here and I'll make it a little bit easier to see. I want to go into the sections section, right, where you come over here. And there is a button over here where we click add new section. So you're just going to click add new section. And now over here, we're going to give it a specific name. Now, in the case of what we, uh, or what I just got, I purchased the, uh, in this case, what? The product benefits. We're gonna come over here and put in the exact file name that we were given. So in this case, it was QQ hyphen product benefits. You'll see that in whatever you purchase, it will have its very specific name. You wanna go ahead and copy and paste that and then press done. That's gonna create this file. And don't worry about any of this type of stuff. We're gonna literally copy and paste over it in a second. But the important thing is that we came into here, we added a new section, we named it specific to what's in our instructions. I'll show you the specific instructions here, right? It says QQ product benefits, and then we click create section. So now what we're gonna do is insert the code. And there is a text file over there. We'll be able to see it inside of our uh, folder uh, that we got when we purchased, in this case, the product benefits. We have the, the code there. We're gonna simply just copy and paste it uh, first, we're going to delete everything, but then we're going to go ahead and copy and paste the code that they provide and place it directly into that section. So coming over here, we don't need any of this, so we're going to delete it all. all right, we can click Save if we want. Now we're going to go and grab the file or the code inside the text file that they delivered us. So it's going to look something like this. We'll want to go ahead and copy all of that and simply place it right over there press save. Very, very simple. We're not editing anything in here. We're not creating new code. We're just copying and pasting code that they gave us. Okay, I'll come over and bring these instructions back over here. Once we save that, we'll now be able to go into the theme editor. So now we'll close out of this. We'll go back into the theme editor. So we're back into our normal theme editor over here. And now it's just a question of where do we want to place this new section? And remember, I've got the product benefits section. So let's say I'm going to put it directly, um, I'll put it ab above this section over here. So we'll come over here and here's our image with text. So we'll click down here, add section. Okay, we're going to take a look and look what we have over here. Our quick code product benefits section, right? That, that was the extent, you don't need to do any more code now. That was the extent of what we needed to do. Just copy and paste that into the area. And now you see over here, we have just like any other part of our theme, fully editable sections. 
So we have all of the different areas here. We could even create different classes if we're doing advanced uh, CSS, but you see we're gonna be able to customize the section, right? You're gonna see it upload over here and right over here, right? We can put uh, product benefits and we can change the element over here. We can see how it looks. You can kind of change the styling, change the look. Come over here, we have section text, right? Anything you want here. And of course, what you see is what you get. It just updates right over here. We'll be able to actually go ahead and then have the different kind of styling inside of these sections. So this is really giving you full control over the section. You see here it is top to bottom. And when we want to move it, right, we literally just come over here and we could go ahead and grab it and just simply move it right over here. So I will put it uh, up there. Oh wait, that's a little bit too high. So let's go down and we'll put it over here. So you simply customize this as you see fit. Of course, you're coming over here into each of the different sections over here. We'll be able to create the different images that we need to go over here and we can go ahead and set all of this up. I'll just go ahead and quickly grab some images just to show you an example and uh, place that right in there, right? We can kind of change how we want everything to be and start to customize the look and feel of this, in this case, using different uh, product images over here and we'll be able to uh, fully build one out. So let's do that. So I went ahead and added those images over here and I set up this style here, change background colors, all that, of course, change images, change text, remove text, right? I removed the descriptions underneath here. So very, very easy to use. Make sure you're always pressing save. And just like that, we have the product benefits section available just like we could any other section. Now in this case, adding it to our homepage. So I'm gonna do the exact same thing now, but for the marquee announcement bar. Same thing here, creating a new section, naming it exactly what they say in this instance over here. Then I'm gonna go ahead and replace all this with the code. Okay, there you go, replace that, press save. Now we're able to go back and exit out over here, go back into our theme. And in this case, I'm gonna add it to the top right over here, so I'll click add section. And we have our different available sections here. And we'll go ahead and click marquee over here and you're gonna see it gets added over here. Now we have the option, of course, to move it up. We'll put it a little bit higher so it's all the way on top, but we'll be able to put what's gonna go on over here. You have your section class if you wanna do advanced CSS stuff over here. Now we can put in the text. We'll put in uh, early holiday sale. Everything gets 25% off this weekend. Okay, we'll put something like that. We could add an image in here. We could have image positioning text. We could have buttons over here. I'm gonna come over here, learn more and we'll be able to come over here and let's go into our collections and we'll do our uh, featured collection for that button. We could slow down the speed if we want. We can, or I'm sorry, speed it up or slow it down. Here you see the higher the number, the slower it goes. So it really just depends on what you want. Gap between text, you can set that up as well. Uh, and you actually have full control, you see over here, mobile as well. So you can set it for some of these settings to be very specific to mobile. So you have full control how this is gonna look like. We could set a background color over here if we want, let's go ahead and uh, do a red, something to get people's attention. Set content max width in terms of what your, and this is typical for the Shopify theme 1280, you come over here and do that. You can have margins, you'll see if we change this, you'll see different margins on top from this bar. We can go even to set zero margin, put it straight on top over here. You see top padding, if we scroll down on this, you see the uh, box gets a little bit tighter. So you have full control over how this is gonna look. We could literally go through all these different settings it's really gonna be all about what you're gonna see over here inside of this little headline marquee bar that we now have. You could, of course, change the font as well. Change the font size, do any of that type of stuff. And you see things get a little bit smaller down here. So really change it however you want. <clears throat> Make the spacing bigger. Full control, all right? So you might like that, how it looks better. Here's our little button. So we have call to action and you see the ability to really get down even on mobile with the different padding levels. So really like this, this is the same idea as the announcement bar, but honestly, we don't need both. We can now remove that boring announcement bar and have this marquee that is, you know, again, we did all this in terms of just a couple seconds to set everything up here and customize it. You can really use this as a cool, powerful selling technique. And not a lot of stores have that, right? They're gonna have this announcement bar, but they're not gonna have something that is this customizable and that has this motion that's gonna give that attention. So I really like the addition that we have over here. I'm gonna go ahead and save that out. And again, all it is is just creating a new section in here. And that's that one time where you have to look at the code. You don't need to edit the code or anything. You just have to look at it. So very, very simplistic. 
Uh, we have our marquee. We also have, of course, our product benefits section, and the list goes on. You saw all those different ones in this store here. So that was quick code. Super, super easy to use. Again, all it is you have to do is just find the section that you want, purchase it, and then follow those instructions step by step, just like you saw over there. Really easy three step process. And you get a brand new section in your store to fully redesign any type of storefront page, product page, section, home page, whatever you want. You'll be able to find a pre built Shopify section over here. So, again, link directly below this video. Go in there, find a section for your store, go ahead and implement it and see that conversion rate increase. I hope this video helps you make some money and I'll talk to you real soon.